In this question, an equilibrium in this question, an equilibrium reaction is shown. Means this reaction is in equilibrium. And the forward reaction is endothermic. So if we have an endothermic reaction, so in endothermic reaction, the reactants have low energy and the product is having a high energy. So N2 O4 will have low energy, where 2 and O2 will have high energy. And what we are doing, we are in, first we are increasing a temperature. So if I increase the temperature, we have both reactant product, but increasing a temperature, most of the reactant absorb energy and form back form the product. So as a result, if more product is formed where the equilibrium is shifted, equilibrium will shift towards the right hand side. So A and B cannot be a valid answer. So A and B are totally wrong. Then, what about the pressure? If you are increasing a pressure, increasing a pressure will always shift toward the equilibrium or the balance towards side where we have less particles of the gas. So when we check the number of the particle here, we have one particle and here two. So where the equilibrium or the balance, when we increase the pressure, it will shift towards side where less particles. So in this case, it will shift towards the left hand side. So in, in this case, I could increasing a pressure, shift the balance towards the side where we have less particles so in the reactant side, we have less particles, so it will shift towards the left hand side. So increasing temperature causes a shifting towards right, but increasing pressure in this one shifted towards the left. That's why option C is a valid answer. 